Today let's check out the United States Capitol, its architecture, design and see it up close. So stay tuned only on the epic travel adventures. In front of the US Capitol, right on the Union Square, you will see the statue of the cavalry charging on the right. On the left, you will see the Ulysses Grant Memorial completed in 1924. Grant, who is sitting on his mighty horse, was the 18th US President as well as the American Civil War General. A war that happened between 1861 to 1865 and fought between the North and the South. The US Capitol, often referred to as the Capitol Building or simply the Capitol, began its construction in 1793 and completed in 1800. In 1962 it was extended. Located all the way east of the National Mall, the Capitol seats the legislative branch of the US government composed mainly of the US Congress. The legislative branch is responsible for making the laws in the US. This is the back and the west side of the capital. As you can see, it is barricaded and this is as far as one can go. The capital was built in a neoclassic style. As you can see, the capital area is huge and it covers ground of about 4 acres.
Capitol building is a massive and beautiful building. Did you know that presidential inaugurations are held in the Capitol every four years? This is a commencement of a new four-year term of a US president. This is the front and the east side of the capital. The building is massive and the construction is extraordinary. Did you know that both the House of Representatives and the US Senate share this capital building? The House of Representatives is the lower house of the US Congress, with the Senate being the upper house. Behind the capital sits the Supreme Court and the Library of Congress, the world's largest library. On the right side or the north, as we are looking right now, is the Senate. On the left side or the south is the House of Representatives. In the middle is the dome with the rotunda right below it. Rotunda is the circular room in the center of the capital. On the top of the dome is the bronze statue of freedom standing at almost 20 feet was placed on the dome in 1863. If you notice, the Statue of Freedom depicts a woman in a military helmet holding a sword in her right hand and a shield in her left. It's about 98 degrees here, 98 degrees Fahrenheit, but you know what guys, for this beauty I'm gonna film for you so that you guys can see. Back to the Capitol reflecting pool located on the Union Square, did you know that it covers an impressive 6 acres in size? By the way, the pool occupies over half of the Union Square.
Next, let's head around the city center of Washington DC and feel the vibe. Don't miss this opportunity only on the Epic Travel Adventures. And if you want to see more of my awesome videos, then make sure to follow, subscribe, like, and of course hit that bell down below so that you do not miss any of my new content. See you in my next video.